Chelsea headed into Atletico Madrid back protest new Wanda Metropolitano Stadium to become the first visitors in the Champions League. With Diego Costa in the stands watching his new team following his departure from Chelsea, the mood was set to celebrate a new ground and a new player. However Antonio Conte back protest Chelsea were about to crash the party. Conte had, for once, made a slight alteration to his usual 343 formation, dropping with one of the attacking wingers in favour of the more central Cesc Fabregas. It was more a 3,412 formation. Eden Hazard was recalled to the starting eleven for the first time this season following his broken ankle. Gary Cahill returned to the team as captain and he started alongside David Lewis, who is currently suspended from Premier League games, but free to play in Europe. Chelsea made a positive start and Hazard looked particularly sharp, the balance of power in the opening exchange as was firmly with the Blues. Hazard fired a shot that, that crashed against the post, but despite the pressure, a goal would in back quote T come. It was Madrid who eventually took the lead courtesy of another rash defensive blunder. David Lewis needlessly pulled at the shirt of Lucas Hernandez, conceding a penalty that Antoine Griezmann converted. Whilst Gary Cahill is the current flavour of the month as fall guy amongst the Chelsea faithful, David Lewis has shown signs of reverting back to the player Chelsea fans remember from his first stint at the club. A rash challenge in the game against Arsenal when a red card followed the red mist, coupled with tonight back protest incident that leaves supporters hoping it back protest not the case and it is just a blip. Madrid led by that single goal at half-time into the second half and it appeared that Madrid were out to frustrate and break up Chelsea back protest momentum in any conceivable way they could. For a while, it was a plan that worked but Chelsea got themselves back into the game quickly and rebuilt their rhythm. Eden Hazard, relishing being back playing again fired a low cross into the penalty area with 60 minutes on the clock. Spanish scoring sensation Alvaro Morata got the slightest of glances on the ball, diverting it past Oblak in the Madrid goal. Chelsea kept up the pressure and still looked most likely to find a winner. Cesc Fabregas and Alvaro Morata both missed chances to seal a victory. Diego Simuan, in an effort to try and force a victory bought on ex-Chelsea favourite Fernando Torres. A flurry of substitutions by Conte in the final 10 minutes saw Willian, Andreas Christensen and Michi Batshuyi introduced, replacing Hazard, Fabregas and Morata respectively. It turned out to be a game-changer for the Italian. As the clock ticked down to full time and with play entering the 94th minute, Marcos Alonso fired a ball across the penalty area and the man who knows all about big goals, Michi Batshuyi was in the right place at the right time to smash the ball home from close range leaving the forlorn keeper no chance. For a game of this intensity, in Europe, to end with Chelsea winning with the last kick of the contest and to still have 11 men on the pitch was something Chelsea fans are not used to. These games nearly always end up badly for Chelsea, maybe the tide that was instigated by Jose Mourinho is beginning to turn. Create your survey with SurveyMonkey click here to join in the debate on the club forum.